I want to talk about this is the broadcast. Hello, my baby. Got back here, and welcome to another video of Law Law Talk broadcast. It's gonna be a short broadcast because I don't have that much to talk about TV shows. So before I get into the topic of TV shows, I want to you to know that. Should I do the right thing to switch to a new game, which I'll do making videos and play on my own? As you know, I'm running out of ideas to talk about for each broadcast um, video. And I've been thinking of playing Madding Gear for one, for one week and then next week. We could go to Lost Talk broadcast. I'm not sure what kind of experience I'm going to do for Nightingale, Gale, but uh, we'll see about it. And I don't know what the, what the, what the series could be named, but I'm going to name this Nightingale video game as all. But, but yeah. Um, you're, you're welcome to open su suggestions to uh, certain uh, series names for the Nightingale Let's Play, and that's pretty much it. So, I have to say. So, anyway, let's move on to our topic of TV shows. So, what is TV shows meant about? Well, they're based on streaming services is such as Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, and HBO and be so. Um, well, I would say call Max, but you know, the point is uh, quite addictive to, to watch these uh, TV shows based on these streaming services. Yes. Uh, okay. Last month in January, they 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 released a TV show called Housing Hotel. Now this was was in the works for quite a long time. I think like four four years or three years years, and they put the the plot of the of the show on YouTube. Then the company got a green light, like that they wanted to put it on air. Apparently, Amazon, Amazon Prime, brought brought the product and decided to launch it to the streaming service. Yes, it's actually a pretty good show. It's the real life of how demons and angels survive. I. But the fact that our uh, overlords, we have we have are the high ranks of demons, and and the sinners, which are actually the low ranks of demons. Then we got at the middle rank where the the seven deadly sins are, which is which is actually is which is where it's actually pride. Satan is wrath, and so on. Yeah, but I had that much about. The seven daily sins in in this series yet they didn't gain that in season two. Season one was actually the the high man meant of angels and demons fighting against each other uh, and who is going to win. And and if you didn't if you didn't watch it, definitely do watch it. That's pretty good. You know, it's actually a animation musical uh, series. Uh, each episode has two songs. They have two songs. Uh, they're pretty decent. They're pretty good. Not not the best songs, but they're actually uh, worthy to listen and watch the episode. So, so yeah, definitely watch Husband Hotel. No, and do so. Uh, another TV show that I did enjoy was actually. Was actually 
Joey, I think I'm just gonna do a last video. Tell on my safe TV show. Oh, let's do this one. This TV show is actually very popular. People want to want to know what's going on with it, and that is how to how to think. How to think is a city area in North Carolina. Uh, it's like the middle of North Carolina, where where the ocean. Atlantic Ocean is located. It's the two sides of Outer Bank, and that is the rich side and the poor side. Uh, but there's a third one, one in the middle, or, and that is uh, you could be rich or you could be poor. It's very up to you. If you're poor, you gotta work for the being rich. So yeah, the thing about Outer Bank, they they go on they go on a mission to find this gold. To see, they they realize if this gold is, is actually real. It's a family gold heirloom that that it cannot be fall into the wrong hands hands. And that what the series was going through, through, through it was like a a journey to catch you to catch the the gold to make sure that the, the enemies don't um, catch you or kill you. Whether whether it goes through through that they are um, go insane like against against. So, so yeah, and they're working on another season of that show. So, uh, it's really cool. I'm like, I actually do like it a lot. Yeah, there are other series I can talk about, which is, which is actually the Marvel series. So the Marvel shows are actually kind of interesting. Do so, like you got Wonder Vision, and you got Miss Marvel, or Or, and and many more. Oh, the one thing I did like about them was actually the storyline of of each cities for each superhero. Hero. If you didn't watch Miss Marvel, oh, then you wouldn't then you wouldn't discover the movie. The Marvels, oh, after all, uh, you may know who is Kamala Khan, who actually is this Marvel in these shows, and you may know uh, who are the rest of the of the characters of the Marvels. If you didn't watch Captain Marvel, yeah. Captain Marvel in, in these shows, so yeah. Uh, another series that I did experience with was actually Cobra Kai. Now this, now this series actually brought back uh, Karate Kid uh, in the 1990s or the 1980s. Those those were like a classic. Yeah. And when they unleashed Cobra Kai, this is actually a, a level up. Of, of Karate Kid. Kid. These two sides fighting against each other uh, in tournaments, karate tournaments, and realize who go win. And if they, if technically, the um, Cobra Kai had, had it all, they wanted to conquer. Um, uh, the heroes of of fighting, like the right way of fighting instead of the wrong way of fighting, and, and that what the series was actually referring to. 
too. But if you didn't know, there was a third enemy. Me and uh, Kovar I did not know who who was this third enemy, but no one knew about him him in these cells. So why? Because only one student, um, the Friday actually, knew about him. And he was and that was it. Yeah. So there's not so what happened, these two uh sides actually create join together to to defeat this dead enemy. And that was gonna happen in the next series uh, next season in season finale. Two sides join together fighting against this main this main villain in as all. But I think it's not gonna be him it's gonna be his psychic in these cells. So yeah. That's a good that's another good that's another good uh series on Netflix. Definitely watch it or the buy. Alright, this one is actually the re is actually right between two. Uh I'm gonna explain two TV series on Netflix actually. The first one is Dragon Prince. Dragon Prince is a series where where a sorcerer and a future king, he's a kid, he, he's actually a, a king, kid, but it was like, um, I think it's, he was 10 years old on the first season and then as he grew up, he realized how to become a king. Uh, like a young, a quite young kid, king in these cells. Apparently, their father actually got killed by a group of dark elves in these cells. A familiar dark elf actually betrayed her tribe and joined on the hunt of bringing this dragon egg to the, to the dragon mother. Uh, and <laughs> apparently it hatched, so we're not gonna bring this dragon to the dragon mother in these cells, or the baby dragon. Yeah. So, it's actually a pretty good series, series in real life. It, it, and also, it, there's actually this villain, and he dies, dies in the end, they come back to life, but under a curse. Curse and this now why that because of her daughter because of his daughter brought her back brought him back to life. So he's under a curse, curse as all, and this powerful dark elf. Uh, I wish I knew his name. He's called Anboga, or Anboga, uh, and he. Is trying to find a way out of his prison, out of his prison cell, and come to the real world, cell in these cells. That's what the the heroes cells are trying to stop. Make sure that this dog elf does not escape his prison, prison and uh, where he is. Actually, I don't, I'm not sure where where his prison is actually from. So yeah, all right. The second one is Arcane League of Legends. Now this is actually is actually pretty decent in these cells. It's between the battle of of siblings, siblings sister versus sister, uh, sister, and you got Jinx is the is the main villain, and and you got a whole bunch of other characters that are coming back that. Um, that actually betrayed Jinx, Jinx uh, being being a hero to the, to themselves. Uh, it's like analyzing each character 
von der Liga als ein Game. Uh, LLL. Ja, das ist ein Und. Ich sage, es ist eigentlich sehr gut. Es ist eigentlich sehr decent. Ich mag das sehr. Und das ist so. So, ja. Definitiv watch those two series on Netflix, Dragon Prince and Arcane League of Legends. Okay. Uh, okay. Hey, if you like criminal justice, which actually is like crime fighting, maybe in these cells, you would enjoy Loki on Hulu. Uh, Loki is a series that started with three, uh, three three swords, but they all started as Loki's series, and when a year went by, they, they all became pirates. And these so each uh, each person had a a patrol that was like a, a uh, like a first class class of of teaching the workers about about being a policeman or police woman and, and it goes well in itself it's quite it's quite unique unique and it you get to experience how how the drama uh, works out between each uh, each character in the in the show. Uh, so yeah. Now I I do want to talk about cancer. Um, shows cancer shows means. Means they are cancelled, but they can come back. Okay, so cancel shows means they they are cancelled, but they can come back back if they if they are welcome to. Some series are can are cancelled and some are not. Like some of them, like some of them I can't feel right after that, where cliffhanger and some of them are, are finished. They just, they just finished their season, the, the season finale at all. All. Uh, yeah. There was one series I got canceled right after the bat. And when it when it was out, oh, it was not a list, but I, but I do know what uh, what it is. What Snyder is? Okay, so hold on. Something. Okay, so one thing. Uh, So it's called Juniper and the Phantoms. Phantoms. Now that series got canceled. Cancel, okay. And now why did I? Now why did it get canceled? Well, let me look it up. Uh, I'll be right back. Here's why. So this series got canceled, actually. Why? Well, first of all, let me explain what this series is about, actually about. So Juniper and the Phantoms is a a comedy musical series where the three boys meet a girl, a girl, 
Uh, the three boys actually are ghosts, the dead, and these girls. So, and they try and defer their, defer their, um, end goal to live, to come back to life. Right. Uh, they actually do, so, and these so. Now, it leaves on a cliffhanger because of a villain. Now, a villain comes up in these so, and, uh, he doesn't want these three boys to before their their cycle or come back to come back to life. He failed the mission their mission. Now he must get back by a uh suit from them and and that and that where it ends in the story. We don't know nothing about that. The show got cancelled way right after that and why that because there were not enough people watching the show. Here's why. However, it, with this older audience, which is us, all adults, ready to watch anything that a opera put out in, in Netflix. So they put so much effort in this show, but they, put, but they sent out a whole bunch of other uh, Netflix series, series in these shows. So, oh, now that's what I hate about Netflix. Okay, from, uh, 100%. They, they, um, release these new series, these new Netflix series, and they don't focus on the, on the old Netflix series, like, work on the, on the next season of them. And, like, we just got, the new series, like light action show of Avatar, uh, is actually pretty good. The last, the last and better Avatar that, that was actually Wizard of Fall and Nickelodeon. And so yeah, and I do like it. so far it's actually pretty good, decent as well. Quite different than, than the animation series at Nickelodeon, and but I say the next. The Netflix series is actually a little more better than the, than the animation series. So, yeah. Good, okay, but, but uh, back to this. So, uh, actually, that cancel. So, so, the Netflix demand was all over the place. This common thing is reason why Netflix canceled the series. It if they wanted to show that fought in younger demonic uh, teenagers or kids, uh, Jennifer and Ben and the friend did not have enough. So this was kind of a uh, kids slash adult uh, TV series on Netflix and. And it was not enough people watching it. We didn't, there's not enough audience that can do so. So that well, that was actually the main problem of it. I don't know why that was, why they they accepted that, but I believe it was they were they were not making enough money for the next season. So yeah. And, and that's actually pretty much it. So, I don't want to spoil it, uh, spoil it too much, but, uh, I think it's actually a good thought to, to experience other ones, I think. I'm actually not really, uh, canceled, but maybe like some that actually got, uh, ended. Ended, so. Okay, so let's go to the one that I do know the most. Okay. okay. Um. Let's do. There's a lot of them. Okay. Um. 
All right, here you go. Sharon Bone. Sharon Bone got only two seasons. Two season after all. Yeah, and there was going to be a third season, but um, but not enough popularity to watch it. Watching series, hey, I think it got less views in season two than in season one. Um, so that's why it got canceled. Okay, so we're, there was no season three of Shadow of Bone, and just like this, you know, it's, it's a series, like a spin off series of Six, six of Crows. I'm not sure what that means, uh, means in these though. But the news were, were hit me hard and, and was heartbroken to do the discussion. Jen, remember trying to gratitude, but it did, not, it did not work. Yes, and we're let down again for the series. Um, series after throwing two seasons after all. Oh, I think the first season, then they did, they just sent it out, out, and they knew that they were going to cancel. So, so they just wanted to finish, uh, finish the second season and just put it out. We don't want to do anything with it. But, um, this movie, we did not, and that was actually, uh, a letdown to a lot of people. And maybe a few people. I don't know. No, cause I didn't, I didn't enjoy it when I was, when I was watching it. It was, it was, it was decent, not, so, yeah. Yeah, uh, there's a lot of, so there's a lot I don't know, and some that I may know. No. Uh, well, this thing. Okay, so Young Sheridan is not actually, uh, getting canceled. It actually is ending it, the, the series with season seven. Um, uh, Young Sheridan is actually a spin out series of Big Bank, you know, Bing, Big Bank Theory. Okay, where this young, where this, um, Sheridan boy, the main character, uh, uh, Experience his young life by uh, being a kid, going through high school and college, age, and now going through the way of being in Germany for some for his summer program for for college. Basically, it's like three months in in Germany for his summer uh, college class. So yeah, and and it's actually a pretty good show, and I do like it a lot. So yeah, it's actually quite decent, and this the season finale, wait, well we didn't get experience that Dragon Father actually dies, um, all um, which actually is big, it's a pretty big uh fight against everybody in the show. So yeah. And I think that's actually yeah, pretty much it I have to say about this topic. So that's it for this video. Let me just tell you what next. Next is
The next one is dancing, which is Japanese tap dancing or hip hop. So I hope that helped you pretty good in doing so. But I'm going to leave the video here. Thank you so much for watching. And click on better to get to comment, like, and subscribe. Go to the link. You follow me on all my social media accounts. And I'll see you next time. Bye.